I started getting interested in becoming a doctor when I was in late high school. I started with uh, advanced biology courses and that sort of sparked my interest. I am Dr. John Basso and I am a clinical associate professor of otorhinolaryngology here at University of Pennsylvania School of Medicine and I am a member of the Division of Rhinology in the ENT department. Most of the patients I'm seeing uh, have uh, severe sinus disease. They've been operated on numerous times. They have recalcitrant nasal polyps. They have asthma and many of them have a condition known as Ashman exacerbated respiratory disease, which is a subset of that group. And that's one of my main focuses and, and, and also my focus of research as well. My um, care philosophy has always been to be extremely thorough. You really can't miss things. There are a lot of little things that make you get a diagnosis, little um, findings that tend to go unnoticed that often become the, uh, the basis of your uh, diagnosis and treatment plan. I like to individualize treatment plans based on individual patient needs and preferences. So there isn't one size fits all for all patients, even with the same diagnosis. Trying to turn up those little uh, answers to questions that perhaps may have been overlooked often makes the difference at the end of the day. And I remember one patient who I had completed my aspirin desensitization treatment on. He called my office three days after the procedure. He said to me, Doc, I just wanted to tell you, I can smell. I can smell for the first time in 20 years, and I just wanted to let you know uh, this is the greatest thing for me. The goal of excellent, outstanding care is an everyday, continuous quality improvement type situation here at Penn. Our outcomes keep getting better, but we won't settle until things get better and better, and, and I think we'll ever settle. There'll always be an improvement that, that can be made.